Hey, it's Janelle Waz, and welcome back to another Star Trek video. Star Trek had a lot of great episodes, but it also had its fair share of weird ones. And explaining those weird episodes to non-Trekkies is admittedly kind of fun. So today, I'm describing some of Star Trek's weirdest episodes in 10 seconds or less. And of course, this isn't an exhaustive list, but it's enough to weird anyone out. Let's make it so. Engage. But before I go further, make sure you subscribe to my channel. I talk a lot about Star Trek, video games, and whatever else I feel like talking about. And if you'd like to help support the channel, consider becoming a member. Be great to have you aboard. Ensign Ricky takes off biohazard gloves, which results in his dying by butter knife, Sulu taking his shirt off, Nurse Chapel turning into Waxana Troy, and Spock crying. <laughs> The Enterprise learns that the secret to beauty is gummy vitamins. Self-confidence works too. Everyone gets high off spores. Kirk detoxes everyone by calling Spock ugly. You belong in a circus, Spock. Not a starship. Right next to the dog-faced boy. A chicken cutlet attacks Spock and tries to force him to build a spaceship. Bones cures him by flashing him. And I'm also quite blind. Spock has PMS and throws soup against the wall. Mrs. Spock makes him fight Kirk to the death, where the prize is marrying her. There's murder afoot, and everybody blames Scotty. But it was Piglet all along. Oh dear. Oh dear, dear, dear. Everyone keep back! Alien steals Spock's brain. Bone surgically reattaches it and flips off the camera when he forgets how to doctor. Remember your old Farmville farm that was crammed with animals? Imagine that as a planet. Space hippies arrive and prove that no matter how deep the Enterprise goes into space, they're still not far out. They take over the Enterprise with the sounds of the 60s. Hey, out there. Hey, out there. Spock eats meat and turns into Captain Kirk. Kirk swaps bodies with an old girlfriend and Shatner acts like a catty woman the entire time. This was the series finale. Perpetrated on Captain Kirk. Wesley steps on some flowers and gets sentenced to death. I guess SOMEBODY should have read up on this planet's weird laws, Tasha! After a terrible date, Jordy tries to date a holographic version of one of the Enterprise's designers. When they're all about to die! This is a holographic simulation of one of the propulsion experts who designed the Enterprise engines, Leah Brahms. Picard is replaced by a replicant. He's pleasant and tries interacting with the crew. Everyone else is uncomfortable. Come cheer up, my lads, tis to glory we steer To find something new in this wonderful year Remember Jordy's hollow girlfriend? Well, their real one showed up and found his hollow girlfriend after he tried to creep on her unsuccessfully the entire episode. Pretty sure she made up a husband, too. It was a professional collaboration. Oh, I can tell. The crew becomes obsessed with a weird 80s 3D game, and only Wesley actively resists it. Data saves the day by flashing everyone on the bridge. Riker is an actor in a psycho-thriller play that becomes a little too real. No one let Beverly pick any more plays. After reading her grandmother's sexy journal, Dr. Crusher dates her grandmother's ghost boyfriend. That ghost would one day go on to be First Minister of Bajor and date another redhead. Mm. Brent, how many voices can you do? I don't know, 20? Great, let's use all of them. What? There are no others like me. Picard begins to turn into a lemur, Troy into a frog, and Worf into some horrible mutant because Barclay got bitten by a spider. Spider-Man, this is not. Th I missed the part where that's my problem. Something something, the Enterprise becomes sentient and is a train on the holodeck. Hey, I watched Next Gen on a loop and I still can't explain this episode. Cisco and the crew have to hopscotch their way to freedom. It's all Quark's fault. O'Brien tries to go on vacation, makes out with his wife, and ends up getting arrested. Cisco gets him acquitted by staring down the court. Worf is forced to go on vacation to Ryza and ends up joining a cult and destroying the weather grid. It starts raining. Bad. And we have 178 different words for rain. Right now, it's glemoning out there. And that's bad. Honey, I shrunk the runabout. Quark yells at his mom and she passes out. In response, Quark becomes a woman. The episode gets weirder from there. Aliens steal Neelix's lungs. Cass accidentally burns Tuvok to a crisp with her mind. Tuvok's all, it's cool, wanna continue your training? Tom 
breaks warp time, but instead of getting everyone home in the blink of an eye, he turns into a salamander, kidnaps Janeway and turns her into a salamander, and they have babies! I don't know how I'm gonna enter this into the log. Send in... The Clowns! To torment Harry Kim, Janeway destroys them by making them afraid. I'm afraid. I know. Neelix is depressed and starts selling narcotics. Harry gets the girl, only to find out that she's after him for his DNA. He almost gets killed. Harry Kim gets the girl, and a, ahem, <coughs> disease. Trip sticks his hand in a box and becomes pregnant. Put your right hand in the box. What's in the box? You are pregnant. Travis and Malcolm build a snow vulcan on a comet. Children ask the one question we all wanted to know. When you flush the toilet, where does it go? A poop question, sir? Archer's dog Porthos pees on a tree and becomes violently ill. Archer threatens to do the same, but ends up taking his shirt off and becoming a lumberjack. I'm a lumberjack, I'm okay, sleep all night and I work all day. How do we shoehorn Troy and Riker into Enterprise? By shoehorning Enterprise into Next Gen Season 7! This was the series finale. You wish you could tell them all that this alliance will give birth to the Federation. I think I'm ready to talk to Captain Picard. And that's all the weird episodes for now. Drop some of your favorite weird episodes in the comments section, and let's all reminisce on some of Trek's strangest moments. As always, thanks for tuning in to another Star Trek video. If you like what you see, why not give my video a like and subscribe to my channel? Tell your friends! Until next time... We're Starfleet officers. Weird is part of the job.